We're back with flat nine. I'll open the floor for questions. I'll start with Robin Washit. Hey, Lat. Uh, I just wanted to. Coach was talking about how, uh, with the absence of Derek and Lat, oh, sorry, of Eduardo, you've had to play far more of the five. And I just wanted to get your take on the challenge that's kind of been on you to maybe play a little bit out of position and not being able to do some of the things offensively because of the role you've had to take on um, at the five spot as opposed to the four. Yeah, I mean, um, that's what coach asked me to do. So I just, I just had to go ahead and do it because that's what the team needed at the moment. But um, soon we got Derek and Aguado coming back. So that should be, that should help us a lot with most strength and lengths down there with the big guys. So. Chris Pastnet. Yeah, Lad, have you gotten, you know, frustrated at all uh, with the way these, these last few games have gone, or do you feel like your progress has been pretty good, or, or what do you want to see that maybe be different here going forward? Um, I was a little frustrated, obviously, because things haven't been going this, um, the way we want them to go, so definitely being frustrated, but um, I'm excited um, to see what – what we got going on coming up because we made a lot of improvement in our practice. So I'm very excited to see what's coming up. Sam McEwen. Hey, Lat. Uh, you said you guys have made a lot of improvement in practice. What are one or two things in the last uh, three, four days that you, you guys have made a jump in? Um, you know, just, just trusting each other, moving the ball, and just getting the right looks, really. That's what we've been working on because – and playing fast, just being able to play fast, and obviously boxing out and rebounding as well. So you guys have a lot of really talented offensive players on your team, but I, it, it feels like your coaches want you to be more involved offensively. Um, how challenging is it to to just call for the ball and, and tell your teammates, "Hey, I'm open. I need I need the ball, and I need to take these shots." It's not challenging at all. It's um, I don't know how to put it, but um, I just I just gotta do my part. What, what the team need, um, call for the ball more, get more shots up, obviously, and get more involved with the team. But it's not it's not hard for my teammates to pass me the ball or look for me when I'm open. Connor Hepper? Hey, Lad, how much did you guys learn or take away from, from playing a team like Creighton? I mean, that was that was a top-10 team, and you guys played a really good first, for ha first half there, kind of blow for blow with them. Did you – did you take that away and say, hey, this is kind of what we can be? Or how'd you, how'd you view that game against Creighton last weekend? I mean, I, I, it was a good learning point, really, because we got to be able to play for 40 minutes. And as you guys see on the first half, we, we looked really good. We was right there with them. But the second half, we just, we just, we just mentally wasn't locked in, I believe. So we got to be able to play 40 minutes. And if we can play 40 minutes, I, I believe we can we can beat anybody in the team in the country. Thanks a lot. Any verse for Lat from the group? Seeing that we'll, we'll end Lat and we'll have Trey momentarily. Uh,